Hi, I'm Rabbi Brian. Hi, friends at First Congregational UCC. Oh, hi, Dr. Eric. Principles of spiritual religious discernment. That's a lot of big words. Principles of spiritual religious discernment. What does that even mean? These are some ideas, principles, for our spiritual religious lives to help us discern, to figure out what it is that God, howsoever we understand that word, what it is that God might want from us. And I hope you enjoy as I explain each one of these six spiritual religious discernment tools. Let's talk about kindness. Kindness is a prerequisite. It's something that you need in order to have a religious, a spiritual life. If you are not kind, if you're so full of yourself and you know everything and you can correct everyone all the time because you are smarter than they are, you're not going to be getting much of a sense of a religious life, of an internal life, of knowing what it is that God might want from you. Here's a beautiful quote. Today, I bent the truth to be kind, and I have no regret, for I am far surer of what is kind than I am of what is true. I know often in houses of worship, we talk about honesty and being honest. And I'm going to tell you that there's something more important than being right and being honest. It's being kind. You can bend the truth a little bit. Do you like my sweater? Yeah. You can bend the truth a little bit to be kind. And the kinder you are, the better your spiritual religious life will be. Parents, children, have fun talking about this one, about how kindness is more important than being honest, and then being right.